Jolly good morning. Good morning. We're moving on. <laughs> it yeah. is not raining, Muzzy. I know. It's sad like two hours, enough non-rain, three hours. It's due to start just after ten. It is twenty to nine. Um, but yeah, it's nice, isn't it? It is. It so, is. It's nice to have a break from it. <laughs> it did say, though, thunder and lightning for most of the day. It was lightning early this morning, was actually. It? Yeah. So I'm hoping to get there. We're off to a place called Santillana. Yeah. Don't know what to expect. We've not been to this one yet. I've we? looked around. I've looked around and it looks all right. Small. Yeah. But historic looking and old town mm. and a few museum-y things there. Okay. I think it's going to be pretty good. Brilliant. Um, <laughs> 34 minutes away. It's the other side of Santander. Yep. Uh, let's go do this. Yay. Excited. I'm excited. Now this is going to be really hard to see if I undo the window. There's actually snow all on top of the mountains over there. It wasn't there last night. It, I don't think it was, was it? It wasn't there last night. Yeah, we're still in the car park. That's proper load of snow that is, isn't it? We didn't get it here. No. <laughs> but they had it there. Means it's coming. Look at it, it's mad. <laughs> More snow on the mountains in the distance there, look. Well, it does say it's two degrees. Perfect snow weather. Yeah, I was just gonna say, what is the, the degreeage for snow? About two degrees. Is it? It is a cold one today. So we have arrived. We have arrived. What's your first thoughts? Brilliant. I've got a really good feel about the place. Don't get me wrong, it's not a massive place, is it? It's tiny, but it looks very historic. Very quirky. A little bit different. I don't feel like I'm in Spain today. Do you? No. And it's got a villagey <laughs> feel like it feels like Christmas. <laughs> it does actually feel like Christmas for some reason. I think it must have been the snow on the mountains. I don't know. Yeah, I don't know. So you're prepping some ham and cheese toasties yeah. for tonight. Yeah, going to have cheese and toasty sandwiches tonight. Um, last night's dinner was a little bit of a flop, but at half ten last night we ended up with jack of potatoes, didn't we? We did, so. we did. <laughs> Two nights on a trot. <laughs> so, I already told them anyway, so I'll tell them again. This is the place where there is a torture museum. Yes. Now, I don't think we'll do that today. I no. think we'll walk around today. We might do that we tomorrow. Do. Let's double check it's going to be open tomorrow, though. I think it's just open every day. Um, but it depends on weather as well, so fingers crossed. Well, actually, you said it's got quite a few things here, didn't you? There is um, bits and bats. It's just what's going to be available yeah. at this time of year. We you don't were, know. You were telling me something about somebody's garden today. It's not open until a Friday, so we won't get to see it. We probably won't get to see it. We might. We might still be here. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> um, yeah. It's it's. It looks like it's a pub or restaurant, and they charge you four euros to go into the back garden, which is full of sculptures and things. I'd pay that. Um, everyone's complaining that it's too expensive in the reviews, but there is a massive stone troll back there and I thought it, and he's got his arms open as if we could both put his arms under his arm <laughs> stand under his arms so that would have been a great picture so who knows um, and there is another little museum-y thing which is sculptures again I think and a cave thing or something I don't saying? think that's in within the I don't know I don't know but, um, yeah. but yeah it's, it looks quite historic it looks pretty pretty and we're um, on good form aren't and we? we are on good form we feel good today so come <laughs> with us and babe, guess what we're having also with our tea today? Sausages. <gasps> no. Fish and chips. One more guess. Bindaloo. No. After dinner, we are going to have Christmas pudding <laughs> from Iceland. Oh, yeah. And Ambrosia Devon Custard. How does that sound, honey? It sounds pretty special. It sounds Christmassy, doesn't it? Mmm. Mazzy did suggest earlier. Let's celebrate Christmas when we get back to England. No! Yeah, why not? Not for Christmas. Yeah, I know. Don't do Christmas. Feels Christmassy today, all right? Today, yeah. Enjoy it today. 
we haven't left yet because <laughs> we haven't long been arrived and it's belting it yeah but this isn't too bad no well that's another story but this is snow i want to say snow it is snow it's sleet it's too heavy to go out in but i think it's just one cloud it's supposed to be like light to moderate rain um, but at three o'clock well let's take now for example it's supposed to be about 0 0.6 millimeters of rain this hour yeah at three o'clock there's a massive storm coming it says heavy thunderstorms 8.39 millimeters in one hour and you said you've never seen that before I have never seen anything as heavy as that but if that, that happens that is just going to be like standing underneath a, sh a, a shower. Well, it's that's be really snow. Bad. Look at it. No, that's sleet. What are we going to do then? Because this is bolting it down now. We haven't even shown our pitch, have we? It's not a pitch as such. No, it's not a pitch. It's more of a car park. I would go out, but I've got my fairy jacket on. Look, I just caught a, I just caught a snow drop. Well, that's a sleet drop. No, I really did, so I can't go out because I don't want to ruin this jacket. Will you go out and just show him my pitch, darling? <laughs> go on. No. Just run round the van. Go on. Put those fingers away. You can't see that on camera, luckily. Oh. My. Gosh. Did you just hear that? It's, thund it's lightning and thundering. It, it just did lightning, lighten, lighten, lightning. I told you we can't go out. It's another day in the van then, isn't it? Storm. It's going to have to be. Tomorrow, we've got to get out and get to this museum. I'm not leaving this place until we do the museum and see the town. It's just completely ruining our it, last week, isn't it? Yeah. Our last few days. Especially especially now, because this looks like a really nice place. Yeah. And we were both we in really good form today, yeah. weren't we? We can't get out. No. So it's thundering and lightning. Um, so yeah. So another day they're going to not get a video. They're not going to get a video on Mazzy. No, don't give up. We can still film during a storm in the van. Of course we can, can't we? They'll get this the day after. All is doomed. Have faith, darling, have faith. We're doomed, I tell you. Doomed. That's definitely snow. Honey. Lightning too. Oh, thunder, thunder. Oh, today's not going well, is it? I'm mad, I tell you I'm mad. But I'm gonna do this just to show you our pitch. Yeah, there's big like hailstones on the floor. Don't know if you'll see them really. Yeah, just wanted to quickly show you our pitch. It's a very dark day today. So, we're down at the bottom car park. Apparently there's six spaces. We're the only ones here, apart from workers. The town is up there beyond those houses. Or uh, village, whatever it is. Um, yeah, it's all right. I feel, we feel safe here. Oh, is that thunder? See, look at that, look, it's snow. Snow, I tell you, in it. That's snow. Make slush puppies. I've got slush puppy juice in the van. So yeah, just going to be probably a cosy day. It's getting quite atrocious. We, I'll be honest, we weren't really expecting this today. Um, just want to show you the necklace that I'd actually rescued some little girl had put lots of love into that though bless her and rather than it getting just crushed and stood on i like it i love stars as you can see this is another gift we got given to us and this is something my sister bought for us 
Mersey and Dan look. I do change up my ornaments quite often. Well, there is one big thing. I don't mind being stranded in the van, knowing we've got at least something to eat because we've had quite a few days, quite a few days with nothing and just literally having to make do. Last two days, we've had jack of potatoes, but when I say jack of potatoes, did you see the lightning? It's literally just a baked spud and butter. Ooh. Bang! Where, where are you? That's scary. I've got two things to say very quickly. <laughs> what? Mazzy just kicked me outside in a thunderstorm I with did... an umbrella. For what? I was walking outside and he threw an umbrella over me. It's now, bad. firstly, um, that is very, very, very dangerous. What, to have an umbrella? Yes. It's lightning, did you just see that? Exactly. I just went out with the umbrella to show him our pitch. But do you not know how umbrellas work? Umbrellas, the conduct lightning. Lightning strike the top of umbrellas because they're made out of metal. Yeah. So, no more umbrellas whilst there's a storm. That's my first point. My second point, why the hell do they make umbrellas out of metal? <laughs> you know, you put your umbrella up in, when it's really bad rain and there's a possibility of a storm. Make them out of something which isn't metal. I like my, that's a vintage Burberry umbrella. I've had that I years. couldn't give a monkeys. <laughs> <laughs> That's just it asking to from, die. It saved you from getting wet though, didn't it? It did. Diesel heater on. Candle. Let's get the candles going. Let's get it cosy in here. Just as it's thundering. <laughs> We're actually going to get our gear on, aren't we? Just take a little stroll. We're just going up there, yeah. Yeah. We're probably coming straight back. Probably, yeah. We'll just peek our head round the corner and see what's what. There is a big storm coming, so we've got to get back in. Oh, apparently this place is known for flooding, you said. Yeah, I read in the reviews, but we're not really seeing that. There's a few puddles, but yeah. considering the amount of rain we've had, it's not bad at all. I feel sorry for this guy, there's a council worker. Yeah, there's a few of them out there, yeah. <laughs> literally just being clearing rubbish. Clearing all groundwork as well. Through all the rain. Yeah. Bless him. I, w I actually thought earlier, we'll make him a hot chocolate and take it over. I thought coffee, but we ain't got any milk. And we don't know if he wants sugar. I've got sugar. milk. We don't know if he has sugar and he's Spanish, he won't understand English. Mm. And then I thought, well, we could give him the hot chocolate. Everyone likes a hot chocolate. Oh, and well, I realised it doesn't work oh, with, without electric. Yeah. So, he'll have to do without. Oh, I feel bad now that you've mentioned that. If he's still there later, we'll give him a bit of Christmas pudding, eh, honey? <laughs> no, that's mine. <laughs> right, OK, we've been advised to move the van. Apparently the top of this yellow clothes bank thing there is how high the water is going to be in here. We did ask if this is okay to go up there, but apparently it's for locals. But bless him, I do appreciate him warning us for that. Yeah, literally to the top of these yeah. bins. He reckons it's oh, going to okay. flood all the way down this road. Okay. So we're going to have to move. Gracias. Gracias. Right, he's found me a better place, which isn't as far away. Right. In here. Oh, okay. Um, he's just literally told us where we are. See yeah, this I've bin? Yeah, said it, yeah. It goes Come. up to here. Yeah. And with this Which is the height of that bin. He knows. And I said it's well known for flooding. Yeah. Right, okay. So we're just going to go there. It's not far. Yep. Where, where are we? I forgot where he said now. Oh. Oh, in, in here. In here, yeah. Which Much. is right next to the tobacco place and stuff. So we'll park in there. Directions. Yeah, three minutes. Let's just go there. Let's go there. Right, come on then. <laughs> Let me in. I wouldn't mind Dan blessing me. Just put the clutch claw on. Oh, you I didn't. I oh, I'd slap you for that. Right. So this is opened. Let's go. Never mind. Oh, hold on. I'm not. 
ready to drive yet. Oh, there's people like that in the world. We need more of them, don't we, honey? <laughs> well, that's the guy I wanted to take a hot chocolate over to. Yeah, yeah. But yeah, it's literally, it's about 300 metres away. It's only around the corner, but uh, it will make a massive difference, obviously. Gosh, yeah, imagine it getting to the height of that yellow bin there, yeah. he said. Like he... I was trying to say to him, well, what about up here? Yeah. He was, I think he was saying that's for the locals. This is yeah. for tourists. What he was saying, though, it rush, gushes down yeah, here or something. I think that's what he's saying. Yeah. The river coming down. And, you know, even here, I said, what about here? And he was like, hmm. Well, that's apparently definitely going to be happening. So we'll have to check on this tomorrow, won't we? Yeah, that'll be interesting. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> now, it is down there. Down there. He did say it was going to be OK, didn't he? But I'm looking at that. I don't know, my um, map is telling me to go down here and then now down the next road, so I'm not going to risk going straight over there. Mm, just, yeah. Can you see the... Um... It's so dark today. <laughs> it just ain't... It's just ain't brightening up, lightening up, whatever the word. Nice hotel there, look. Yeah, there's some history there, apparently. Yeah. The buildings feel totally different here. Nice cafe bar restaurant there. There's a zoo nearby as well. Yeah, don't feel Spanishy here. Is that police? No. Right, we're here. We're here, are we? Yeah. Oh yeah, that's oh, much better. Lord, yeah. Oh, bless him. <laughs> yeah, March 2. I think that's what he was trying to say, actually. I think we're all right overnight. That's why I'll check in. Yeah. Oh, a nice little cosy bar as well. I think we should treat ourselves, darling. What do you well, think? We don't need to go anywhere else, do we? That's it, yeah. We've got a bar. <laughs> we're somewhere to park. Oh, we're happy. It's quite cobbly round this to town. Do you sit outside? No. <laughs> Yeah, it's quite coppery round here. There's some kind of it's beanie also a looking. Killer, have you noticed? Yeah. Well, should we get a high just in case, darling? Yeah, but it's the higher you go, oh, the yeah. higher it gets. And then we're going to need ramps, aren't we? This isn't good for us. You'll have to do. We've got no choice. Found our little pitch. I'm not happy with that. I'll be <laughs> we're quite slanted. We we're, we're that way. We slanted. Um. When we open his door, we're opening up to everybody. That's my babe, considering what we would have had. We would have been flooded up to there. <laughs> that would have made a brilliant video. We'll go back tomorrow and check it out. Yeah, but it looks nice. There seems to be a few little shops and stuff up there, pizzerias and stuff. Don't know if they're opened. And, yeah, feels nice up here. I it's like it. It's not ideal. Be grateful. I just don't want to be coming out with my dressing gown on tonight at 7 o'clock and there's people sat at the bar 20 feet away from me having a drink. <laughs> well, it's better than going out in your whalers, isn't it? In your mankini. What's a whaler? Where, you know, where you have to put them on, like what the fishing guys wear. Is that what they're called? Whalers? Like I big rubber know. trouser things? Why would I have big rubber trousers? Because if we were down on? there, if we were down there, you would have to have had them on, wouldn't you? So where does the mankini come into it? You told me you packed it. Clutch glue on. Top tip, take care of your security of your van when you're away. Yep, good little pitch. It's really not. It's fine. It's a nice area. I do like this area. Right, okay, so we're gonna just take a little walk in here, have a quick pint. It's too wet to do anything, isn't it? It is. It's horrible. I'm just not happy with where we're parked, I'm not, but hey, it it's, is what it is. It is. We're allowed to park I'm happy. There. We're I'm happy. Park there. We are. Uh, oh, police are coming. <laughs> oh dear. Right, should Let's we just. Let's get in. <laughs> <laughs> Right, gonna get settled. It's lovely in here. It's actually really, really nice. Not a lot on tap. 
so we don't actually know what we've ordered, but it tastes good. I do like this tablecloth. It'd make for good fish and chip paper, wouldn't it? <laughs> Dan's just checking to make sure the police ain't checking on our van. Is it all good, yeah? Well, we're only staying here because the council worker told us it were all right. Yeah. So we're just taking his word for it. I've, I've read the signs. You don't have to pay... Three March and October. No, after March and March, October. October. Yeah. Um, and it doesn't say anything about no overnight parking, so... Yeah, should be good, should be good. And Go. there's a massive storm coming at one of three o'clock. Yeah. So I really don't think they're going to mind anyone wherever they are. Well... Yeah, that's, it sounds quite scary. I think the locals know how bad this village gets. This is going to be about 8.6 millimetre in one hour. You've ne you said you've never seen that before, well, have you? you think so. about how bad the rain got last night, yeah? Yeah. We are talking six times as bad as that. Wow. In one wow. hour. Right, so yeah, we're going to settle. What do you think of that? It's all right, isn't it? Right. Yeah, it's all right. Oh, it's strong. Is it? 6.5. Oh, no. <laughs> I'm one of these. I don't like a strong strong lager, no, do I? No, I don't. Yeah, no. check all these out. Look, all like cowbells and stuff. I've got the prime seat in the house, though. Look, right next to the heater. Yes. Yeah, just. Well, it's been a good day. I've really enjoyed today. It seems to be stressing Dan out a little bit, all this storm and stuff, but it is what it is, isn't it? It'd be nice to... I don't know, we love being in the van during storms anyway, but I am glad we've moved from the other car park. God, that would have been horrendous to open the door tonight or couldn't even drive out of it. Yeah, so well pleased. Today's been really good. <laughs> Good, good morning. So it is the next day. Hello. <clears throat> We're safe and sound though. The storm never came to anything, did it? No, not really. It is going to start raining again. Stray dog keep time. running up and down there, don't he? <laughs> But no, it's all right at the moment. Yeah, yeah, it never really came to the worst, though, that we were expecting, so that was good. Uh, just got home, had our dinner, didn't we, in Christmas bed in? Do you remember having it? There's a hair on you. <laughs> um, yeah, it was lovely. Yeah, lovely. it was nice. Um, yes, yeah, so I don't know really what we're going to do today. It's still still a bit rainy, isn't it? Yeah. I'll talk in the water, yeah. Yeah, we've run out of water in the van. Totally run out of water this morning. And we're not at an air, so we can't get any water. So luckily there's a supermarket just 50 metres away from us. Yeah. So we're going to go over there, see if we can get some bottles. Buy a few bottles. We'll just throw them into the yeah. tank, yeah? Just a few, because we'll be on an air tomorrow. Just get bare essentials done with it today, can't we? Uh -huh. Otherwise it's going to cost us a fortune. <laughs> yeah, I don't think that's ever happened to us. Well, not for a long, long, long time. Once. Has it? Once we've run out of water oh, before, dear. yeah. Oh, dear. <laughs> so, um, yeah. yeah, let's do that and then we'll go for a walk around this, what looks like it's going to be a wonderful it little village. It does. I'm looking forward to it if we can get in the museum today. Hopefully. One of the best little shops we've ever been to, <laughs> wasn't it? For such a small place. Yeah. A lot... You find that though, some of these supermarkets got, got really small front. When you go in, it goes really deep back. Yeah. Quite a nice one, that. That's pretty much everything we needed. Yeah, definitely. So we're thinking we might have an omelette tonight. Yeah. Put some eggs. Is this where I put the water? Yeah. <laughs> I've never done it this way for years. We got four just to get us by, which is plenty. Um, do we just keep him one out, maybe though, yeah, darling? No problem. That's okay, we'll just put three in. Uh, right, while Dan's doing that, I'll just quickly show you our little haul. So we've got some lovely looking bread, um, proper nice, some eggs, like Dan said, we're going to have a bit of toast and an omelette, uh, toothpaste, a carton of milk, a bottle of pop. <clears throat> Crispies, very liquid, and 
Vicky to dip in me tea for later on. Or me coffee, should I say. How you getting on there, babe? Fantastic. One new wee bottle. <laughs> they're taller than our usual, aren't they? I don't know how many. No, they're only five litres. Ah. Oh. They're a bit taller and skinnier. They aren't look they? quite flimsy, them bottles. We usually sort of get these square ones. But to fill these this up, well, they were only a pound each, so we went for the cheaper ones, didn't we? Yeah. <sighs> Are they fizzy water? No, surely not. Mineral, natural. Oh, I thought I heard a little fizz then when you opened it. <laughs> Try it. <laughs> it's the only time you'll ever see him drink water. No. <laughs> So let's start our tour of Santillana. Centro Historico, that's a good sign, Mazzy. Yeah. That's telling me it's got history. Yeah. And it's this way. So, first things we're seeing, a cafe, a burger bar, and a restaurant. That restaurant looks nice, Mazzy. They all look nice, don't they? With a nice balcony. Now, I didn't know there was a burger bar there. No, neither did I. <laughs> um, but it's funny, there is a pizza place just near his motorhome. Yeah. Right opposite, basically. And we'll just look to uh, see when it opens. Half past seven tonight. Yeah. Half past seven at night before it opens. What's wrong with we'll people? We'll be chewing on each other's legs by then, wouldn't we? <laughs> <laughs> it's a nice hotel, this, though, look. Every building's quite nice. Got a totally different look to these buildings here, haven't they? Yeah. I do feel like we're in England. Well, like France or something. It's not yeah. Spanish Spanish, is it? But yeah, that's a nice. I'd love one of them rooms with that balcony oh, on a sunny yeah. day. Well, no. For such a small place, there's quite a few museums. Yeah, that one looks nice. I don't know what it is. Museum Dio Quesana Bus. Museum Bus. It's a bus museum. Oh no, it's not. Yeah, I don't know what kind of museum that one is. I don't know. But we're going up here anyway. Is that where we're parked? Yeah. I think so. Oh, look at these buildings. My guess is that's the town hall, but I really don't know. But I've never seen such a big crest. That's like six foot tall. Never seen such a big stone crest. Yeah, that's good. It's got mermaids on it. Look. Has it? At the bottom, yeah. Mermaid. Oh, it has. It's got mermaid. Yeah. No, they're mermen. No, the they've men. got long hair. They've got men chests. Huge gate. It's clearly a lot of history here, but we don't know what the history is. No. Right, just check that out. How cool's that? Oh, there's orange tree in there. Oh, wow. And the built building beside you, look, it just looks magnificent, doesn't it? With the balconies and the wooden beam top, yeah. Very nice. Again, look, it's got the bars. This must have been some kind of... Jail or something, yeah, that's quite what possibly. I'm thinking, yeah. It's possible. Yeah. Now, there is actually an app. Let me just give you a wipe. Oh, there is an app, isn't there? There is an app yeah. for this specific uh, town, but it's in Spanish. <laughs> if you want to translate it, it might help you getting around and stuff. It's incredible. We're on the wrong yeah. side of the road to show this one. Oh, yeah. Let's just say... Again, another crest up there. Really nice. They must have been important people. Yeah, it's like every house just has important people in it. Yeah. I don't know which way to go. Which way? Uh, I don't want to miss up there, anything. I'm guessing. Maz is just going round. Ooh, ooh, ooh. <laughs> <laughs> so there's another nice restaurant it's, just down there. Yeah. It's very rare. You see beamed buildings here, though, isn't it? It's wonderful. It really is. Yeah. And there's a little shop there, an artisan shop, which has... Homemade chocolate outside. Yeah. Let me just show them that. Check them out, look. How lovely are them for a little gift? 70% cocoa. 
tempted. Next door. Is that, what's that in the window? That's a pretzel, is it? Oh, it's pretzel shaped, isn't it? Yeah. It's like a cheese straw. This yeah, one, it looks isn't like it? cheese straw. Oh, that's interesting. Oh, but that's well known. Mm. Bank. Never seen such a beautiful hole in the wall in my life. Look at this. Yeah. Inside a little cave. Of course she's stuck in there, look. Yeah, I wonder what that's all about. Are you seen this balcony up here, look? Oh, wow. That needs a good tidy. <laughs> and a good ramming. <laughs> That's brilliant, isn't it? Yeah. Nor art. Maybe they're making things out of them. Oh, yeah, that'd be well good. And you've even got a modern one here where they've kept with the feeling of the rest of the village, town, city. I think they called it a city. I'm sure it called it a city. Is it a city? I'd be surprised if it was. It's very small, but I'm sure I read oh, it's city. Beautiful. I think this has got to be one of the prettiest oh, places we've been everywhere to. Everywhere we go. <laughs> Another lovely little restaurant here. Just looks beautiful. I don't know what kind of... Oh, it's a fuchsia. Like a fuchsia tree. Yeah, I don't recognise any of them. Oh, they have English. Just saw an English sign there, look. We've got plenty of restaurants. Oh yeah, they have it in English, look. Oh yeah. The orange is English, that's nice. Oh, that sounds nice. Got a big statue here, look. Statue. Let's go see the statue. What's this, look? Take your selfie. Take your selfie. Take your selfie. I don't know. <laughs> oh, I'm guessing it's to put your phone in there. Yeah. Just to hold your phone. Well, and then you're going to get, like, a good backdrop. Well, you might get a better view over there if this van wasn't here. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> OK. Beautiful bull. Is it a bull? I think it's a bull. A ram, is it? It's not a ram. No? I don't know. It must be a bull. We're in Spain, Mazza. Very nice. That might help someone tell us. I don't know what this place is. Casas del Aguila y la Para. Free entry. Wonder what it is. No, nothing in English. Something cultural. I've seen something you're gonna know. What's that? And that's free entry, is that behind us, Mazza? But I don't know what it is. Oh, what is it? Museum or something. Oh, okay. It might be an art museum. I don't know. Let's just have a quick look up here. Don't want to miss anything. Parador. Yeah, it's very quaint. It's beautiful. Imagine on a sunny day. It would be beautiful here, wouldn't it? Mmm. <laughs> I don't Christmas really know. It's a set. Oh, it's not. It is. Is it? I think so. Oh, I thought it was like... Well, I don't really know what I thought it was. Oh, it's fantastic here. Getting a, quite a few tourists out now, getting the pictures done, aren't we? Am I reading this right? What? I think this is the level the river's got to. Oh my heavens! I'm gonna have to translate that. That's 91 meters. Well, if it gets up to there, wow! That's mad. <laughs> you have a big crest up there on the on the wall. Can you see it? Uh, I did have it, but it's gone again. Oh. All right, we'll go and have a look at the nativity then. I thought it was like a fighting scene, if I'm quite honest. <laughs> I don't know why, but that is magnificent. Oh, you've, I don't know if they'll be able to see on here. Yeah. To come down it down looks quite permanent, doesn't it? Oh, it won't be, will it? Look at no. Oh, yeah. <laughs> 
Well, they go into to a lot of effort here, don't they, for their nativities. They turn sprouts into artichokes. Oh, yeah, that's so good. See, that's where England aren't. Oh, some castle things at the back there. England don't do that, do they? So no. The not, well, not religious as well. side of it has gone out of Christmas back home now, isn't it? It's all we just about gifts. <laughs> Look how beautiful this place is. Very nice. Right, there's plenty more to see around this village, town, city, whatever it is. Stick with this. You're going to have to watch it tomorrow because uh, we're splitting this video up. Yeah. Um, we would like to thank the following people, as we always do. Yes. Peter Webster. Thank you, Peter. Helen and Ian. Thank you, Helen and Ian. Lynn and Tony. Thank you, Lynn and Tony. Don't it, our fan. We're watching him. <laughs> Paranormal Unlimited. Oh, thank you, Paranormal Unlimited. Pamela Bomford. Thank you, Pamela. Oh, Gaz and Chaz. Thank you, Gaz and Chaz. Don't steal I can my, read too, don't you Don't steal know. my bit. <laughs> Michael Lutas. Thank you, Michael. And Chez. Thank you, Chez. Now, Lovely name, I like that. There was something about this Chez. Was there? Uh, you're just going to have to bear with me. I took a screenshot. Mm. Was it this one? Yes, it was this one from Neil. Neil made a, left a message saying, Glad to see... Great to see travelling through Spain... Sorry we missed you earlier in our pub. Um, basically, could have got free fish and chips and a pint. Oh. Safe trip, <laughs> Shez and Neil. Oh. Um, I don't know where you mean. <laughs> yeah. This pub. Yeah. Maybe you've sent a message in the past and I've just forgotten about it because I do read a lot of messages. You get a lot of people. emails. But thank you very, very much. Thank you for to the everybody. Invite. Yeah, and thank you all so much. Right, we're leaving it here. Yep. Come back tomorrow because there's more to see in this amazing, amazing <gasps> town. One of my favourites. Village. One of my favourites. We'll see you all tomorrow. Bye. Bye de bye. Love ya. Love y'all. No, I said I love them more than you. Do you love them more than me? Yeah. <laughs>